I'm attorney Presley Henningsen with RSH Legal. If your loved one is being admitted to a nursing home, you may hear something about a thing called a care plan. But what does that involve? Let's discuss the details of a nursing home care plan. A care plan is a written document used in nursing homes and in other care facilities to establish medical and non-medical needs for each resident. Each individual's care plan is based on their needs and their individual preferences. Facilities then use this plan as a playbook of how they should assist that resident during their stay. A care plan can include things like what medications are needed, what dosages are required, and how often they should be given, any special diets or food preferences, whether any special equipment is needed like a wheelchair, a feeding tube, or a lift, how often they want to participate in social activities, physical or mental health goals, and anything else that you specifically want to be on that care plan. Care plans are developed by a team of individuals involved in your loved one's care. This includes the doctors, the nurses, and other nursing home staff, and you. Your loved one or someone who acts on their behalf has the right to participate in forming this individualized care plan. Don't be afraid to speak up about what your loved one likes and dislikes, especially if they're not able to communicate this themselves. The nursing home is being paid to care for your loved one, and the staff should fulfill your loved one's needs, if at all possible. If you feel your opinions are ignored or pushed aside, do not hesitate to address this concern with staff. Any care plan should be reviewed regularly to make sure that it's still appropriate for your loved one. For instance, if your loved one recently had a stroke and now suffers left side paralysis, they may now need help with toileting or feeding themselves when they didn't need that before. Their care plan should then be updated to accordingly reflect these changes. Once the care plan is in place, be sure to check that it's actually being followed. Many times staff can become lax in following each resident's care plan. It may not seem like a big deal that staff isn't feeding your loved one at the exact right time, but staff could just as easily be neglecting your loved one with their toileting needs or something more serious. For instance, if your loved one requires help with going to the bathroom and the staff is not around to help them, they may try to make it to the bathroom on their own. This can be very dangerous as they could fall and seriously injure themselves. If you find that the care plan is not being actually followed, speak with the nursing home administration about what you've seen. It's a good idea to keep a written record of any issues so you can provide concrete examples when you are asked about them. If your loved one's care plan has not been followed and it has led to them suffering serious injuries, you may need a nursing home neglect attorney's help. Call RSH Legal at 1-800-433-0283 and speak with one of our nursing home abuse lawyers today. RSH Legal, fighting for fairness. Mm -hmm.